everybody. Welcome. Welcome to my live. Hope that you guys are having a great Tuesday evening. I've got some new product to share. So, so excited. Let's see if we can get some comments. Mm -hmm. We'll sit back. Um, if you haven't caught on from the title, this girl needs wine tonight. It has been a ridiculous day. That's all I can tell you. I need like all the help I can get. Hi, Margaret. Welcome. <sighs> it has been a day. So, I also have chocolate. I will offer you some. It's in a very cute Radon dish. The little Cadbury mini eggs. I only get, look at me, I have like, mm. anyway, anyway, hi Sandy, hi Christy and Priscilla and Cindy, howdy howdy, hi Gail and Tia, hi Priscilla, so we are going to use this fancy guy right here called the Modern Floral, and I want to, so I was sitting here and I'm like, I want to do something different that I haven't seen. I've seen a few people use this and it looks so good on the Hexagon board, which is one of our brand new, hold on, I'm gonna hold it up. One of our brand new, oh look, you can see my setup. <laughs> look at all those cameras. Um, I will take this wrapper off, but this board is totally awesome. And um, it's one of our new reusable boutique boards. So, hold on. Oh, man, I hear a crabby boy up there. He sounds as crabby as his mom. Good gravy. What a day. I could tell you about my day, but I don't want you to, like, feel like I do. Okay. Ugh. Oh, my God. So many things. Okay, so here is the awesome. This is our 18 inch boutique hexagon board. So fun, and it has a hanger right there. So we're not double sided here, we're just one sided with the built in sawtooth hanger thing. All right, so beautiful board. Hi, Darcy. Ready for the ice scale, ready for the ice, just in case I get to sleep in tomorrow. I am fully ready. I wasn't even gonna bring that up because it brings a little sparkle to my eye when I do. The thought of getting to sleep in. Let's do that. Put me in the corner. And, um, all right, so this is our gorgeous thing. And I want to do something different. I do want to use neutrals, though. So I was, like, thinking of, like, the white and the storm. But then I thought, ooh, maybe I could add a little shimmer because you know me and shimmer. And then I thought, ooh, white and gold might be really pretty. I just want to do some centers that are a little darker and just a few things and then just go over the whole thing with white. I think. You know, we're just gonna see how it works. So, first things first, we will mark the back. I will do anything to try to get out of this crabby mood. Y'all are never going to get out of school for the summer. Hey man, last week, Tia, it, the um, governor declared a state of emergency. So we can actually um, um, apply for a waiver to have those days waived. We don't, and we build in multiple days already. I don't want any of this. Okay. Let's 
Sticky, sticky, sticky. Sticky, sticky, sticky. Um, okay. Here we go. Now, I'll take my fuzzing cloth and I'm gonna lay my fuzzing cloth down. Voila, voila, however you wanna say it. Voila or voila. set this aside take a sip of our wine everybody sip together now we may begin okay I am flipping this over and I'm going to fix this on here so that I get the most bang for my buck okay and I'm just gonna kind of, I like to work my way from the inside out so that there are no air bubbles. Ooh, I missed that right there. I don't like that, so now I have to fix it. I didn't see that it was sticking out. Darn it. I thought I was good to go. All right, hold on. I can do this. I can do hard things like be creative and cover each corner. There is a border. Okay. Gosh. All right, I'm gonna have to not be picky. Urgh. This has this is gonna go off a little bit. I don't like. How do I? There are six quarters and only four on the transfer. Calm down. Just do it, you big baby. Oh my gosh. Just do it. Dana! Oh, I'm so happy to see you. Please tell me you've got your wine so that we can drink together. I'm dying today. It's just been one of those days. Like I cannot even. <laughs> can't even. Mm, have to make it up. Um, in Alabama, once the governor declared a state of emergency, then we don't have to make it up. Exactly. That's us too. All right. So this gorgeous, beautiful gold shimmer paste is going to go on some places. Now, I've noticed that this really doesn't dry as fast as the white. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some gold in the centers here and we're just going to kind of leave it at that and I just want a little bit of gold here and there and everywhere like maybe down here and then over here in the center. And then here in the center. I hope this works. Like my plan is I'm just going over this with um, white. So. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, let's do this gold. I just want a few pops here and there. Okay. And we gotta do something up here. And over here. And the rest wait. Okay, good. I don't really have much over here, but it'll be okay. Alrighty. Now let's just cover. I can't open it. I legit can't open it. Oh, I'm going to have to get out another white. All right. Hi, Dawn Marie. Hi, Julia. Hi, Janet. Howdy, Michelle. All right. We're just going to dump this white all over the board. And then we're just going to start spreading the news. Ooh, where's my giant squeegee? It's gone. All right, I'm going to have to use my angled squeegee, which is not my giant squeegee. So I just need to, like, see where I'm going. Got to get off the edge. Getting close to my gold, but not overly close and I can and I'm kind of using the side of this which I don't usually do very often I'm like I need more white this is going to dry because I don't have my giant squeegee what is wrong with me why I am slapping it on, man. I am just moving as fast as I can. Whew. So this, I'm going to do a little blending there. Because I have to. Because I have to, have to, have to. We are moving we are cooking this white is going on fast and furious hopefully fast and furious oh my gosh I'm going off the edge like legit sorry I'm not looking or reading because I am moving fast oh I really 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 would have preferred to use my giant squeegee but I'm sick of like getting up and going to look for things while you guys are on here so I just decided to do it this way and deal with it hopefully I don't regret it can you believe I need more I do and I'm like totally a mess <laughs> ah, it's okay it's all right it's okay we didn't want it anyway okay holy buckets I think it's time to peel nope oh my gosh Ah, it's like the buzzer is at zero. Sarah, you need to stop. You need to be done. Here we go, people. Not supposed to be pulling from this end.
I didn't even mess it up that bad. <laughs> Let's put this in some water and I can stop stressing out. You guys ever just like get sick of me stressing out i love the gold the gold and the white look fabulous i absolutely positively i did it i did it i did it I'm so excited Yay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I deserve some wine. Hold on, that was stressful. Thank you so much. Yeah, this was like up to here before. All right. I can relax. The gold looks really good. It's blended a little bit in some places, but I like it and it will dry. It's not perfect, but it, it, it's fun. Probably what I should have done, except the white dries faster. I should have done it all white and then gone over just parts of it with gold, but it looks good. It was fun too. These colors look good together. So you can totally see my awesome golden, white, and black project here. This is crooked. Does that bother anybody else <laughs> or just me? There, so that's fun. This transfer is really, really cool. Um, This transfer came in my leadership bundle, which I don't know if I would have ordered, but I watched some people use it and it was really awesome. You could even do this on a smaller board and just do like, a little smidge of it and it will be really cool like just get those flowers on there and then you could like do the flowers in a background color and then come back and um, do something over it cheers okay so um here's the honest to God truth this is not the only project I want to do tonight I want to try something else <laughs> and I want to do it with you guys because when you've had, okay, so when I've had a bad day and totally stressed out, like I want to cry, what do I want to do? Um, get on camera, of course. <sighs> no, that's not what I want to do. So, we are going to take a little time to wash our transfer. I have it down on this little, oh, you can't see me. I have it down on this little table, so I'm going to kind of wash the transfer a little bit, get most of the chalk paste off, get the water off. I'm going to show you how I do this. This is a big transfer, so it's 18 by 18, and I, I like will lay it right out here. It's totally a mess. I'm well aware, I'm well aware. It's completely a mess. But I wanna show you how awesome this is. So I've got our little board erasers. They're like two for like just a couple dollars. I'm getting, okay, so this gold, all of this chalk, see how it's just coming right off? Now this is the front of my transfer. So I'm just kinda of getting all the chalk off all the color it's very wet after I get that color off I'm gonna dry it with my towel this is not my fuzzing cloth this is just a, like a cheapy towel from Target it is okay it's okay chalk paste on my brand new floor but it's okay now I'm gonna pull this side down And lay this out and clean that with my board eraser so these do not just erase boards look at that it takes the stain right off and of course it takes the chalk color off before we had these we I always wash in water I always used a Clorox wipe or you know whatever brand wipes that we had and then I saw 
that you can use these on your transfer. So awesome. So, been loving those lately. Now I'm gonna dry this, and I am still, I'm gonna flip it over, and I'm gonna wipe it with one of my wipes, and then I'm gonna like air dry this a little bit. So hold on. Dry this. This is the quick, quick clean. Um, when you have a large transfer and you wanna keep using it. Okay, now I'm gonna wipe it. There we go. So I wipe most of it. This helps bring back the sticky. Did you guys know that? If you have a transfer that doesn't feel very sticky, take it off, flip it upside down, wipe it with one of these wipes, and let it air dry right there. Oh my goodness. Whoops, it does a really great job. Okay, so now, I can, again, like I could dab it with this, but what I, <laughs> what I do is I cheat and I hold it up to my, um, my heater down here blows warm air. It's like a space heater and it blows warm air. And so it kind of dries it pretty quick. Cause this air is so dry, there is like no humidity none whatsoever all right i'm gonna lay it we'll lay it over here on my little drying rack for a second because i have this board and i want to redo it now i'm just going to share with you some things that i do with my boards and i like to be able to redo them i'm gonna sneeze oh if i sneeze again like i did yesterday it was awful so here i'm spraying water on the chalk paste. Now this board is literally just stained and waxed. Stained and waxed. Okay, so we are gonna wash this off and kinda let the, there is glitter on here. So we're gonna get that glitter off. Let's see if I can get that glitter off first. Lots of it's coming off. It's beautiful rose gold glitter, though. Oh, that's pretty. If that isn't filled with wine, I'm not interested. Oh, you have, you have a cup? Oh, okay. All right. I'm sorry. I just saw it up there, and I wanted to make sure you had your water. He wants to make sure I have my water. Okay. Are you going to leave start tomorrow? I'm hoping so. So now I'm using my, I'm not mad at him, but he's part of the reason why my day is awful. I just thought it was funny that he's bringing me my water. He should have brought me wine. <laughs> Got it all off. Now I'm just gonna rinse this off right there in my water. So my day was crazy. Number one, I couldn't sleep last night because someone snores and someone fell asleep before me. And when someone falls asleep before me and they snore, I can't fall asleep. So I laid there for the longest time listening to the snoring. I don't know what happened. Eventually I fell asleep. I fell asleep. Then I fell asleep. Then um, after I fell asleep, my alarm went off. <laughs> So I had to get up with like, I don't know, three or four hours of sleep, which is not enough for me, you guys, not enough at all. So I go to school, I get a text, frantic text from my daughter. Mom, I'm having asthma attack, I can't breathe. Like I can't breathe at all. I've taken my inhaler, 
more times than I should and it's not working. So I'm like, okay, where are you? She's like, mom, I gotta go. N what? what? Uh. She goes, just call the office. I go, no, you go to the office. She's like, I can't, mom. Okay, she's a rule follower. Even if her life is in danger, she wouldn't go to the office because she was in the middle of class. No problem, Karen. So anyway, um, so I had to call the office at her school. Mind you, I'm with my students. Call the office with her school and say, um, here's a weird thing. My daughter texts me. She says she's having a major asthma attack. Can't breathe. Her inhaler's not working. I don't know where she is in the school. Um, I am calling you because I'm... I need someone to go check on her and bring her to the office so that I can like come and get her because she's going to need her nebulizer. Okay. So I go, I leave my school, my, my principal subs in my classroom while I leave, go get her, take her home, come back, miss out on like lunch because I was driving and you know, it's just stressful. I don't like, I'm not mad at it. It was just stressful make her an appointment to go see the allergy specialist, then beg Aaron to go take her there. So he has to leave work early, go take her there. Um, I go right after school, get my nails done, by the way. Cute. <laughs> um, and then uh, what happens? Oh, so then I have to run home, grab Ryan, take him to parent-teacher conferences, then I have to get him to wrestling practice. Aaron, who already took Emma to the doctor, is taking Easton to OT, drive, dropping Emma off, taking Easton, going back and meeting us at wrestling for Easton. I get a phone call when I'm at wrestling. Um, the car broke down and I need to, you need to come get me. So the car breaks down. I'm like, that's it. We are getting a new car. I have decided. We're getting a new car. Like, this is ridiculous. This is the second time we've had it. Like, we're done. I go there. I get Easton. Rescue him. Drive him to wrestling. Come back. He goes, mm, I think I'm out of gas. You think you're out of gas? Hmm. You're 42 years old and you think you're out of gas? That does not constitute I'm broke down. Like, I... He, he should know better than that. I mean, he's a guy, and I'm going to be stereotypical here. He fixes all of our car. Like, he, kn he knows. So I had to go drop the boys off, get them ready, run them in, come leave, go to the gas station, buy a gas can, put gas in. Like, I'm, I know I'm acting like I have the worst life in the world. And I don't, but it was just like so annoying. And then the whole day, like I was just stressed about other certain things and I am done, I'm here, I'm drinking wine because I can't day drink in my job. <gasps> oh. Um, oh, Susanna, when my kid is like, in um, like a stressful situation, my thought is to say like, like me, I have to go fix this. So I never think of other people. I just think of myself going to take care of her. I could have certainly said, can my like 18 year old daughter or my almost 18 year old daughter bring her home so she can get her nebulizer? But I didn't, like she just, you know, they just need their mom at certain times and I wanted to like assess the situation. So, anyway, it was fine. When I got the phone call, my principal was in my classroom anyway, it kind of worked out. She's like, all right, you go, I'll stay. And I'm like, okay. So anyway, yeah, but I'm, I'm here now, I'm drinking. She's still not completely recovered, I will tell you that. And she did get like an emergency appointment with the doctor, which is awesome. They put her on some inhaled steroids to get her through whatever's happening. 
And she's now, she's like, Mom, I'm so embarrassed. I said, why? She goes, Be because I cried at school because she was in the middle of her exam in her phys ed class running when she had this attack. And so she was like completely embarrassed because she cried. She's like, I can't breathe. She couldn't even make out the words like, I can't breathe. Like she couldn't even speak sentences. That's how bad it was. And she's like, I did my inhaler so many times, mom. I'm only supposed to do it twice. She goes, I did it way more than I should and it still wasn't working. So it's a scary thing. Like it's normal. I go, you know what? I would have cried if I couldn't breathe. It's okay. So I'm using Fawn here, which is my all time favorite color to use on stained wood. All time fave. There are lots of bits and pieces, nooks and crannies. I feel like, did you guys see me do the one where I was sanding the buffalo plaid? I feel like this is one where I could do a background and sand part of it and make it look really old and distressed. I love, I'm gonna have to open up some new fawn. This is the last of this. Okay, are you ready? One, two, three. Only a couple parts did I mess up. Only a couple parts. Very cool though. I'm gonna grab my fixing tools and get to town on fixing this little thing. I probably did not push it down as much as I should have, like I did on the first one. but it's nice. And this is a much smaller board. So you just get a real intense picture. And how fun, like, how do you keep it from not drying the transfer so fast? Like mine would have already been dry and peeled up when I take it off. Crystal, I understand and maybe, I don't know, I you know, it is really dry down here, so I'm not gonna say it's not drying as fast, but I'll tell you, I'll tell you what, I think sometimes we don't realize how slow, well, I don't know, I'm not there to see you, but when I'm working with people um, here at my house or I'm watching them chalk, I don't think people realize how slow they go. And that's not a bad thing. It's just like kind of, I don't know. I think it comes with just a little bit of experience and practice. And I don't know, I don't know. Because sometimes I think people do all the right things and it still dries. Um, yeah, I don't know. That looks awesome. I'm so excited. Doesn't that look cool? So you could use this just as an its own piece or uh, you could um, make a cluster, a cluster of pieces that work together. So like this could be a background piece and you could stagger some smaller pieces in front of it. Um, like if you were using this on a mantle, you could do that or hanging it on the wall, you can have other coordinating pieces around it. Because this is just a little small guy. Well, not as small as five by seven. This is like about a nine by 12 size. 
That's the size board it is. Um, I am so glad you like it. My house is dry. Well, no, we do run a humidifier. So I think there's like a bit of humidity in here. So that could be if your house is super dry. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. It does kind of look like carved wood. I'll hold it up so you can see it's definitely not perfect. Like there are some little splotchy areas, but it looks good. I, If you just take a piece of wood and stain it and wax it, the fawn is like the most beautiful color with it. I absolutely adore it. So here you have two totally different pieces. If I turn it this way, like it'll look totally different, you know? And you could you could turn it any way you want, whichever way you need like the pop of that big flower. Oh shoot, oh good, it's dry. Um, and then I have this one. So the same transfer, two totally different ways. Totally different, um, but they're awesome. This is a fun one. This is called Modern Floral. It's a D size. It's on the website. This board um, is on the website. And of course, the gold shimmer paste is on the website. It's all available right now. Um, yeah, so, and the fawn, of course, all those colors are available. There's also silver shimmer and copper shimmer, which I don't have yet. I only have the gold, but it's coming. I ordered it. So awesome. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to do my usual thing. If you are not a designer, but you are interested in learning how to make some money doing stuff like this, especially on a bad day when this is therapy to me, it is cheaper than therapy so this is what I do this is my outlet I love 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 I totally just messed this up because I dripped water on it I dripped water in multiple places so we're gonna we're gonna try to fix that but um what else fun chalk yay you're welcome Janet if you are interested in learning about the products and you want to get inside my customer VIP group, type in the words, add me. And if you loved what you saw here tonight, hit the share button, share, 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 and um, share with your friends and tell them how awesome this is and that you guys should watch together. All right. Interested. Woohoo, Tina. Um, if you are interested in learning about the opportunity, type join, and I will give you a link to our group where you can watch a video that tells all about being a designer. And I think that's all for me tonight. Um, I think that's it. Unless you have any questions, it's pretty, it actually is pretty easy. Pretty easy. So uh, have a nice, enjoyable night. If I have a snow day tomorrow, I will definitely see you again. Even if I don't have a snow day, I will still see you again later on this week. If not tomorrow night, Thursday night for sure. All right, guys. Yay. All right, I will get you that information, Tina. I will talk to you all later. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Bye, guys.